back in Greece, but this time not for Athens, but uh, in Patra. Uh, it just feels good to be back to play in Greece. Uh, you know, I played here for three years, so pretty much most of my professional career. So, you know, I'm happy to be back. Uh, you're a part of a team uh, like Virtus Bologna that wants to come back in the uh, in European stage with uh, great teammates like uh, Milos, like uh, Markovic. You feel part of a great big project. Uh, you know, it's the beginning of the year, so there's not a lot of pressure right now. Um, you know, we can have a great season. We all know that. Um, just got to stay, stay together and um, just got to stay together down the line and don't let that pressure get to us too much. Probably you know that uh, Armani Milano is in the uh, in the top for many many years. I guess one of the targets is to be back in the Italian first place. Uh, yeah, definitely. That's that's definitely one of our goals. Uh, you know, we we all understand that we didn't make the playoffs last year, so you know that's something big for us. And of course, Euro Cup mm -hmm. is another big goal. So you know, we have we have we have our plate full this year. And you know, like I said, we just try not to let the pressure get to us. Mm -hmm. Let's talk about the memories in Nike. What feelings now you have after you you were part of a very successful team with uh, trophies? You celebrated many trophies in Greece. Three, right? Yeah, we won three three, three cups. So you know, that's very special to me. Um, uh, probably never won something so big and so so much. So you know, it was very important to me, and you know, it was a special special moment with Ike. Which of the three trophies was most important for you? Definitely the uh, BCL. And the Greek Cup was definitely something big too. You know, nobody expected us to win that. Nobody expected us to win the BCL either. But you know, going up against a top Euro League team like Olympiakos mm -hmm. and they uh, powerhouse, that was something special. So you keep in touch with uh, ex-teammates in Nike? Uh, yes, uh, pretty much everybody for the most part. You know, we're we're all good friends, and them relationships don't really go away that easily. So I, I keep I try to keep in touch with all mm -hmm. my teammates. Which moment you will never forget from your presence in Greece? I would have to say the BCL championship. You know, all the final four that yeah, the took final place four in was Athens. Something amazing, like you know, we had so many fans there. Um, Sold out both games, I, I believe. So you know, it was fun playing in front of all them fans, and you know, I'm really grateful for it. Mm -hmm. What missed from Mike to make the next step, and probably you know that one of the biggest targets was, was to be in the first places of Greek League. But what missed from Mike Athens, especially last season that uh, Olympiakos did not participate in the playoffs? I don't know if we missed anything, but I know it, we kind of fell short of our goal. You know, we missed the opportunity going into the uh, Greek Championship mm -hmm. last year with Olympiakos uh, forfeiting. So, you know, we missed the opportunity and then we fell short of the Final Four. Just some of the little things, um, you know, we lost by two points mm -hmm. to uh, Bambert in the um, semifinals or the quarterfinals. So, um, you know, just a little thing. And then we lost by one, one point to... Mm -hmm. You know, Parcher, so, you know, we just missed our goals just by a tiny bit, and we had a great team, and, you know, we just felt short, and, you know, that that's basketball that happens sometimes. By the way, what happened, I don't know if now it's okay to speak for that, uh, we have seen some stories of you on Instagram about that, about some tips, about something like that, I don't know if it's over or, or uh, it's history. Uh, it's not over, but I, I really don't want to talk about it, I, I really um, don't want to talk bad about Ike or anybody. Uh, they're a good organization, you know, they, they treated me good for two years. Mm -hmm. um, you know, just a couple of things, you know, we have to worry about other than basketball and, you know, we're going to handle that. Mm -hmm. And finally, as for, as for Virtus Bologna, with uh, what uh, you will be happy at the end of the season? This is really a season where, you know, everybody has to set their personal goals a little bit to the side. And I'll be happy if we win. In the Italian league and the Euro Cup, and you know, mm -hmm. that'd be a blessing for, for me and mm -hmm. for us.